Welcome in to this edition of Great City Attractions. Today we visit the capital of Estonia. These are the Great City Attractions of Tallinn. Alexander Nevsky Cathedral. Among the best things to do in the city of Tallinn is to visit this amazing place. Named to commemorate a victory by a Grand Prince of Kiev, this Russian Revival-inspired cathedral was constructed during the 19th century. Its large domes, of which there are five, give the cathedral a striking symmetry. During the times of the Soviet Union, the church fell into disuse and disrepair. Rich mosaics can be seen on the exterior of the church and entrances. Freedom Square Lying at the southern end of the old town of Tallinn is Freedom Square. It's an important part of the city of Tallinn, hosting concerts and state functions. The most notable building on the square could be the neo-Gothic St John's Church, built in the late 19th century, while a monument marking the Estonian War of Independence, fought between 1918 and 1920, overlooks the square. Veru Gate Tourists to Tallinn will be struck by just how much of the town's defensive walls remain. The Veru Gate is part of these fortifications. The gap between the two towers you see once saw a large entry gate. Today this part of the city is a busy hive of activity, with shops, restaurants and markets all in close proximity to this major site of Tallinn. Old Town of Tallinn You'll find plenty of charm, history and things to do and see within the Old Town of Tallinn. Tallinn Old Town is notable for its degree of absolute preservation. Indeed, it's led the site to be acclaimed a UNESCO World Heritage Site from the 1990s onwards. Walk back in time here viewing original merchants' houses, barns and warehouses, and a number of medieval churches. We'd love your support. Feel free to subscribe to the channel below. Lahime National Park One of the great Tallinn day trips of note. The Lahime National Park is within easy reach of Tallinn and is an excellent day trip away from the city itself. The park is the biggest in the country and one of the biggest you'll find in all of Europe. The natural landscapes here are punctuated by large forest. Red deer, wolves and bears are known to roam within the park, while there are also a number of popular manor houses to be visited. Perita Convent A 15th century monastery, today the convent of Perita lies in ruin. An order of monks and nuns once resided and thrived here, with the monastery being one of the largest in the area. Protestant Reformation meant the monastery fell out of favour in the 16th century, with troops under Ivan the Terrible moving against the monastery in 1577. Town Hall and Square One of the highlights of the old town of Tallinn. The amazing town hall building dates back to the 1370s, and is known for its famous weather vane, Old Thomas, which is nearing a 500th birthday on top of the hall. The square itself is lined with bars and restaurants, while also being a gathering place for small festivals and concerts, and of course the bustling market scene. St Olaf's Church Religious buildings of importance are dotted throughout the city of Tallinn, one of the most notable of these being St Olaf's Church. Named after a king of Norway, the church is said to have originally been built in the 12th century. The church has been the focus of natural calamities on a number of occasions, with both lightning strikes and fires damaging the church numerous times throughout its history. Tall Hermann A tall tower called Hermann. Forming part of the Tumpia Castle, Tall Hermann offers great views from an observation deck at its greatest height. It was first built in the 14th century, although the tower people climb today is from the 16th century. Hermann proudly carries the national flag and plays a vital role of tradition when it comes to Estonia's Independence Day celebrations. Kadriogi Park This palace includes an extensive and beautiful park and surrounds. The grounds here are known for the Swan Pond, or lake at its western end, while an art gallery is also to be found. The residence to the President of Estonia and a lodging that was once graced by the presence of Peter the Great are also within close proximity. Pateray Sea Fortress Located on Tallinn Bay, this is a place you probably didn't want to end up in over the past centuries. Once a fort and barracks, the buildings were converted into prison cells in 1919. 
with over 1,500 prisoners able to be housed here after renovations of the 1930s. The prison was then used by German forces throughout World War II. Today, a number of museums are being planned to showcase the varied history witnessed by the stone-cold walls here. That concludes this edition of Great City Attractions. Subscribe to the channel. What's your favourite place to visit in Tallinn? Comment below.